Hey everyone, this is Saile and welcome back to another interesting video. So here we have a question that square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x is equal to cube root of x and we have to solve this for the value of x greater than 0 that means for positive value of x. So if you look at this carefully then this expression contains radical signs right and to solve this equation, we must get rid of this radical signs and then we can solve for x. Some of you may think that we can square on both the sides or we can cube on both the sides. But that is not the case because if you square on both the sides, then we will get 1 plus square root 1 plus x is equal to x raised to 2 by 3, right? This is same as x raised to 1 by 3. So by taking square, this will be x raised to 2 by 3. But again, this is complicated, right? Now, if you take cube on both the sides, then we will get 1 plus square root 1 plus x 3 by 2 is equal to x, right? But again, this is complicated. Now, some of you may think that we can take 6th power. So let's look at the 6th power. So by taking power as 6, we get 1 plus square root 1 plus x its cube is equal to x square right but again this is complicated right because we have to apply the formula of a plus b the whole cube here and then we have to solve this expression so i have a smart way to solve this so let's get started so here we can put the square root of 1 plus x as y which is some variable now you solve this expression for the value of x that is we can take square on both the sides 1 plus x is equal to y square right that means x is equal to y square minus 1 right now you put this value of x in the original equation so we get square root of 1 plus this is y is equal to cube root of what is x y square minus 1 right now take the sixth power so this is just 1 plus y raised to 1 by 2 right square root means and this cube root means y square minus 1 raised to 1 by 3 now by taking power 6 this is just same as 6 by 2 which is same as 3 and this is 6 by 3 which is 2 right so we have a simple equation now let's solve this so here we have again a formula for a square minus b square what is the formula this is just a minus b times a plus b so here we can write this y square minus 1 as y minus 1 times y plus 1 and then take the square right that means square of this which is same as take the square of this and take the square of this right and this 1 plus y its cube as it is now we can cancel this 1 plus y square from both the sides since y is equal to square root of 1 plus x we are taking positive square root and y plus 1 means just we are adding this one right so this is positive quantity that means it is non-zero so we can cancel this y plus 1 on both the sides rather square of y plus 1 on both the sides so by cancelling that we have 1 plus y is equal to y minus 1 the whole square right now let's just simplify this so this is same as y square minus 2y plus 1 right a minus b the whole square is same as a square minus 2ab plus b square so by using that formula we will get this and this is just 1 plus y as it is now again simplify this so we have y square minus this 2y take this y here so we have minus 3y and 0 here so we have the equation y square minus 3y is equal to 0 this is very simple equation so solve this so we get take y common so y minus 3 is equal to 0 that means what y is equal to 0 or y is equal to 3 right now if you put y is equal to 0 then 
so if y is equal to 0 then this equation gives us 0 is equal to square root of 1 plus x now square on both the sides we will get 0 is equal to 1 plus x and that means x is equal to minus 1 right but we want the solution for x greater than 0 so y is equal to 0 is not the correct choice that means we should have this y is equal to 3 so just put y is equal to 3 in this equation we will get this as square root 1 plus x is equal to 3 now solve this for x right because we want the positive value of x which satisfies this equation so by squaring on both the sides we will get 1 plus x is equal to 9 that means x is equal to 8 right so there is only one positive solution to this expression which is x is equal to 8 now let's verify this quickly so put x is equal to 8 so we get 1 plus square root of this 8 plus 1 is square root 9 which is just 3 that is equal to square root of 4 which is 2 and which is same as cube root of 8 right so x is equal to 8 is the solution for this expression i hope you have enjoyed this problem thanks a lot for watching